Okay, let's talk about serapeptase. This is an interesting one. Serapeptase is a proteolytic enzyme, which means it's, a, it's an enzyme that digests proteins. It was discovered in the 1960s in the digestive tract of silkworms. And when a silkworm goes into its cocoon, spins that silk cocoon, and it turns into a moth, the moth ejects this enzyme to dissolve the cocoon so it can go out and fly. And researchers in, 19, in 1960 found that this enzyme that the silkworm releases contains a compound called serapeptase. And they can now recreate that in a lab. And serapeptase, as I said, is a proteolytic enzyme. It, it digests proteins. It's been used in Asia and Europe for decades now. It has very, very strong properties. Very interesting. First of all, it's a very strong anti-inflammatory. And we all know, I mean, all of the research now in all the medical news is that inflammation in our bodies, especially chronic inflammation, is very bad for us. And so anything that we could take on a regular basis that's natural, that would naturally reduce inflammation, would be good. Not only is serapeptase a natural anti-inflammatory, because it reduces inflammation, it can also be used for pain control. And there are many studies where they have prescribed serapeptase post-surgery. Uh, in one study in Europe, they were doing it post-surgery on repair of Achilles tendons surgery. Uh, they've used it in wisdom tooth surgery. And it has been proven clinically effective in reducing inflammation and reducing pain. One of the unique properties of serapeptase is that it dissolves a protein called fibrin. And fibrin is produced in our bodies to form scar tissue. And one of the components of arteriosclerosis is fibrin. It is an insoluble protein. And so we get this damage in our heart arteries and fibrin collects there, cholesterol collects there, and calcium collects there. And serapeptase has been proven in clinical trials to dissolve fibrin. So it is my hypothesis that by supplementing with serapeptase, this helped dissolve the fibrin in the blockages in my heart, which led to me having a clear coronary artery calcium score. But serapeptase is an interesting one. And we have definitely included serapeptase in the protocol for its anti-inflammatory properties and for its, its fibrolytic properties in that it dissolves fibrin.